Okay, now what we will do is uh, we'll try to get into meditation. Uh, so please, all of you, close your eyes. Sit erect in whatever way you can. Just keep the spine erect. The posture which I have helps me to go to the core of my personality. Very quickly, I will be able to adjust and reach the core, this consciousness. That is why the posture is important. I observe the breath at the tip of my nostrils. The inhalation and exhalation. This body is breathing since birth. Automatically by the will of the Lord. Cosmic will controls the functioning of the entire universe. This body and mind is a part of the universe. The mind in this body is awake. The sense organs are awake. The ears are awake. They can listen. When the sense organs are awake and the mind is awake, it is called as the physical world. Consciousness is the light illumining the physical world, including the sun and the moon. They all come to light. They are all known because of the light of consciousness, knowledge.
I am the power behind the mind. Surya. Chaitanya. The mind in the dream is only with the subtle body. The gross body is dropped in the waking world. With the subtle body, I experience a dream world. I am an awareful being pure divine being, conscious being. The mind goes to sleep. In the sleep state, there is no physical world, no subtle world. Everything is an undifferentiated form, causal form, which is called as the seed state. The state of ignorance. I am aware of the sleep state. I am aware of the waking state. I am the awareness which never changes. Pure awareness. The divine being. My real state. There is no sorrow in Turiya because the world is resolved. Prapancho Upashama. The three states are governed by the law of universe, the Panchabhutas. There is an inner controller, Antaryami, Ishwara.
I am none of the three states. I am a pure being, Turiya. I remember this teaching of the Upanishad. when I am facing the world. This is the lighthouse in which I remain. Om stands for the three states of consciousness. A, U, Ma. The silence at the end of Om represents Turiyam the pure being, divine, eternal. Changeless. substratum for the entire cosmos. I will chant Om. Remember the meaning when you hear the sound. Remember the silence is my real nature. Repeat this exercise in your own meditation whenever you can. This is called diving into your own real nature. Being with yourself, the real self. Dropping the ego self, the waker I, the dreamer I, and the sleeper I, they are all the states of the ego, the mind. I am unconnected with the mind. The body is connected to the mind. I am the light of consciousness, which reveals this body and the mind and resolves them into myself. Oh.
I become aware of the pure presence. I retain this throughout my life. And carry on with all the interactions. I have learned to develop the space between me, the Thurian, and the mind. Become aware of your breath. Slowly rub your palms and gently open the eyes. <laughs> 